Disney. We had the best morning and now we're getting ready for our first of a few Christmas parties. As you can see, um, I'm like in full girl mode getting ready. I think I did okay. I think Andre is nailing it over there. I'm gonna turn off my jazz music and chat with you guys, but we're in Disney for Christmas. I think you can see all Andre's Christmas gifts are in there. We're going to go from Morticia Adams to Martha May because we need to be jolly. I'm also trying to find a purse. So this is the um, most epic rain. It's not thundering or anything, but there's like a huge rainstorm outside of all the days. So today is our holiday Christmas party for the neighborhood. And we've never gone to this because we're usually at home in Canada. I just need a bag and I don't know what to wear. I'm thinking this one. I don't know. Now we're going into like, Babe, are you? Oh, it's Andre that said I needed to wear this one. I'm gonna put my insoles in so I can dance the night away. Babe, you're the one that said to wear this green thing, right? I think the green one's a play. What do you think? You don't think the green one's a play? You're very handsome. Thank you. You look really good too. Well, like if we're being honest, I'm gonna wear neither because I'm gonna overheat. But it, it gives Christmassy vibes, you know. More importantly, what do I do with that red feather? Just oh, where's your jacket? It's over there. Where's in your jacket pocket? So it's Peter Pan themed. We're not really on theme at all. We had we a theme. We had plans. We had plans. We had plans to be on theme, but then it just didn't work out. But then we ordered clothing off of Amazon and that didn't turn out. Oh, this is way, is this not way better? This is way better. This is way better. So, okay, girls come in, you guys get this. I had like the most beautiful green dress planned and I was gonna be like very Tinkerbell with my Tinkerbell shoes and it was super cute. But it's that time of the month and I'm like super bloated. So here's what I did. It's like the most truthful moment ever. And I feel way better. So I'm wearing flats so I can actually dance. This dress has shapewear. So I'm in, you wouldn't know it, but I'm pretty sure I gained 10 pounds this week. Like if you know, you know, if you're, if you're a woman, these things happen to you. And it's probably like going down as my worst ever. It just hurts a lot. So I just took a, I don't know, what you, an anti-inflammatory, like a Midol. I call, they're Maxidol in Canada. They're amazing. So then this hooks on, I'm, I'm also complete, like maybe I'm, I don't know, maybe I'm premenopausal because I'm having a hot flash too, but. Those of you that are screaming, put the green one back on, I'm so sorry. That will be for the next Christmas party. This is, Andre, I like this one better. And this goes better too. Okay, and here's what I'm doing because it's raining. I pulled these out of my like 21 year old days when I used to go clubbing. I used to put these in my purse. If you don't know what these are, these used to save me back in the day. So the idea is you can just put them, they're flats, they're called fast flats. You can put them in your purse. Back in my day, <laughs> they were the bee's knees. Okay, so I think we're good. This morning, we had the most special morning. Andre had the very good idea to go to, we've been saying like, let's go to Pop Century for a meal. Cause Pop Century is near and dear to our heart. It was the first resort we ever stayed at as a couple. So we went for breakfast and we sat at the same table of my first Disney eating experience. We had a sloppy Joe at that table. And that was like when we were kidlings. Andre, how old would we have been? Like 19? Oh yeah, yeah we were late teens. Cute. Let me put these in. Cause you guys know I'm trying to take care of my feet. Let me put these in my little slippers. So I have Tinkerbell shoes. They're still Tinkerbell shoes, but they're not like the beige ones. I don't know if you can hear the rain. It's like coming down. There's like a full storm today of all the days, but it's fine. Um, so we are pre-gaming with our friends in about 10, 15 minutes. So we're gonna head over there. I'll take you guys with us, but I wanna show you the invitation to the Christmas party for this one that we're going to. And then in a few days, we're going to Jolidays, which I'm not showing you the outfit yet, but that's, well, you kind of got like a little snippet of it, but I'm thinking that's what I'm gonna wear for that. So you're gonna come to a few Christmas parties with us. We're gonna decorate and do all the things. So come see the invitation. Okay, so I have everything here. I just wrapped these. We're doing, I don't know if you've ever heard of this, but we're doing a drunk elephant exchange. So the idea is that it's kind of like white elephant, but you get like booze. So we're doing that as our pregame. Where is the invitation? It's right here. So I have all the gifts for friends behind me and I don't think I should show them. <gasps> Can I actually, I need to show you this. So this was a gift to me whenever we arrived. Does this look, I wish you could answer me. Like girls will get it. When you're just not feeling your best, it's hard to feel and look your best. 
Just saying. Okay. This came in from a friend of mine. Like, I can't. First of all, these little vintage sand napkins. And she, she made me this. So I want to do like a bar area themed as this. So the sweetest ever. Okay. I want to see the holiday party invite. So there's like some leftover fairy dust on this. So I'll also like, I'll take a couple shots at the party of the entrance. Cause this is apparently gonna be amazing. So it's like all Peter Pan themed. Oh yes. And the Halloween decor is still up, but Tony needs a shout out. Tony takes care of that solar god. And he was like, Angie's not gonna want Jack Skellington up when she gets back. And he took it down for me. So I'm gonna take down the rest of the decor, but I so appreciate that. I was saying to Andre, he should put like the black feather in his pocket, but he doesn't, the pocket doesn't actually, I mean, we'll see, I'll ask him. F Pixie dust. So every year there's a theme. Last year it was seven dwarfs. We couldn't come obviously, so we're at home in Canada. This year it's Peter Pan themed. And they did like a formal invite. Mr. and Mrs. Darling, you know, like Angela Darling in Peter Pan. And then they gave this too. I'm gonna put this in the Bambi room under the Bambi book. But it's like one of those like vintage style books. So apparently they go like all out with these parties and the decorations and there's characters and everything. I mean, what else would you expect from Disney? So hopefully it's incredible. Apparently there's tons of food, tons of drinks. Um, it is like a ticketed event for the neighborhood, which is kind of cool. And we've wanted to come for years. So we're finally doing it. And I'm kind of like nervous, excited. And we gotta go. And it's raining super hard. So I think I'm gonna take off my little slippers and we're definitely not gonna take the golf cart. I'm gonna take you guys with us, like as much as I can. Like I'm not gonna share anybody's like, I just feel like it's kind of like a private thing, but I wanna show you the decor at the party, so. So excited. Okay, let's do it. Pause. Audrey, come show what you did. Yeah. We're like, and with my fur, can you bring the fur? Where's your fur? Right there. Uh, and I put like a fur, I didn't put like a huge effort into my hair because it's pouring, there's no. Yeah, it's gonna oh, don't forget too. to, oh. Yeah. Okay, look at what it's, you're giving that, Captain Hook. I love it. That's good. Mom and dad are going out. Carl would be so proud of us. Carl would be a lost boy if he was with us. <laughs> okay, now let's really go. As you can see, I'm hurting today. So we're gonna hydrate. I'm debating doing liquid IV or something to bring me back to life. I'm not really sure. Andre and I just brought Mickey down from upstairs. So I'm gonna put him on the front porch and we're gonna go from there. I need to get, is, can you see on the banister? Yeah, I still have all the, the Halloween stuff up, which is so weird. It feels so strange. Like I'm literally looking at a Halloween tier tray. So I gotta take all that down and transform into Christmas mode. So I think I'm gonna put on a Hallmark movie or a good Christmas movie. Right now we're listening to the new Epcot area music and it's so good. I need to wrap gifts, there's a lot. But yesterday was like insane. I didn't get a ton of footage because <laughs> the second that we walked in, we just started having fun. Um, I did meet Captain Hook and Smee and I totally fangirled over Smee because that was like the one character that I was hoping was there. Captain Hook was not nice. But I mean, he's a villain, so it's cool. I tried to shake, I asked him if I could shake his hook because that's what he does. And he was like, no. And he went like this, be gone child. <laughs> it was fun though. Um, the food was super good. The, the drinks were a flow in. It was so busy, it was packed. We danced, we started up really, really late. And this morning went for a nice walk. So I'm gonna try and recuperate and decorate. So hopefully we can, um, thrive and survive today. So let's decorate. Starting with Mickey. Let's do it.
Disney Springs, we were both really hungry. So we had some pizzas, it was delicious. And I wanted to go to Uniqlo to get some treasures. And I feel like I was successful. So for tomorrow's party, it's supposed to be a little bit on the colder side. I mean, it is December. I was gonna say January, don't get ahead of yourself. So I found these and I thought that this was perfect. And I get this question a lot, like how do you handle the weather in Florida whenever it's not warm? This is how. You don't, like Andre and I was talking about this, like when you, li when you live in a cold climate like we do in Canada, you have a jacket and stuff. So here I find what happens is either because you're traveling or like you're in a hotel, you might not be equipped. This is a really good way to conquer the colder evenings. Like it's supposed to go down to, I think eight degrees, which is cold. Um, I think that's Celsius, yeah, eight degrees Celsius. So this is called Heat Tech and I got leggings of it as well as a shirt. This is the shirt and I was gonna wear it under my dress and it has thermal inside. It's like a little black turtleneck, which is also like, it's kind of cute. And then I got the Heat Tech socks. And this was $30 and the leggings are $30. And then I got the socks, I got scrunchy socks. So I'll wear all this tomorrow under my dress and it's gonna be cozy. And then you don't freeze your tukus off at night. Ooh, I like these. So I'm probably gonna wear these to dinner tonight because we're gonna go for a little golf cart ride. I'll take you with me. So I'm gonna watch a movie and get this kitchen cleaned up. Um, our fridge is broken, so that's fun. The week of Christmas, our fridge is broken. No big deal. So we're gonna try and get that fixed this week. We have a big week ahead of us. And I'm gonna share all the things with you. So tomorrow is Hollywood Studios. Tonight we're gonna lay low, obviously, because yesterday was crazy. Don't really feel like socializing or drinking or doing anything tonight. So I think we're just gonna go to the, we're gonna go to the lobby bar at the Four Seasons. It's one of our favorite spots to go to. Um, and then I'll just decorate until, like clean and decorate until then. Just get all the boxes and packages out of here. But we brought Mickey outside, so that was a success. I went and searched for Park Pals in Disney Springs. Didn't go well. It's all good. They're cozy. They're like long johns. <laughs> they're not like the sexiest tights, but they're cute. And they're warm. All right, let's decorate. We're gonna drink some water not have a cocktail and clean and get this place ready for Christmas. Let's do it.
Go outside, the snow is falling down And every child is having so much fun The snowman is twice the size as me With a smile as quirky as mine We're holding hands to keep each other warm While we stand and watch a choir perform And all the Christmas songs that we love Yeah, all the Christmas songs that we love And in a while we're gonna go inside And drink our chocolate by the fire all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy Mm-mm, so beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you I don't need any presents As long as I spend this day with you Mm-mm, so beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you Making plans for what we're gonna do I feel so blessed that I can be with you Cause God knows that I've been longing for ya yeah, I just wanna hold you close you know, Listening to an audiobook and Christmas music I look like a, like that I'm serving hot chocolate But I kinda love it So, listen, obviously was not supposed to be wearing this And if you know me, you know that I wear next to nothing all the time But it's freezing out even for a Canadian but I found this like, it's called like heat tech something something. I showed it to you guys yesterday and then I have the leggings of it. So I'm probably gonna put, like we're not going bare leg, I'm gonna freeze. And then I have chunky socks. But there's also like this little cape that I could put on this. I get it, I look like a little Christmas waitress but I'm kind of here for it. I think that I'm gonna be like, I think we're gonna pull this off. At first I was like, you know what, screw it. I'm just gonna wear a sweater but Cute, right? Right? No. Full green. Like little elf. Okay. My Christmas book is so good, and I have like Christmas jazz music playing on top of it. I think I'm almost ready. Oh, and I put like a little fur clip in, and, and, and. I have this to put. I doesn't, it's pretty close but just in case if my ears are cold because my ears get cold. Okay, we're going to Jollywood Nights. I'm so excited. So we have reservations at Sci-Fi Drive-In and then we're gonna go ride all the rides. Andre's gonna want to ride Toy Story Mania like a million times. It's gonna be incredible. I decorated like almost the whole house today. I just wanna say I slayed and putting that tree outside was the right choice. Okay, I feel like I had a really good day and it's ending with this. <laughs> it's ridiculous, but I love it. Do I look like I work at the North Pole? <laughs> I love it. Okay, and it's all fur, so it's warm. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go to Hollywood Studios together. Christmas 
the party. Today has been kind of like a slow moving day, but a really good day. So this morning, Andre and I woke up pretty early. He went and did a workout. I didn't because I'm trying to really, really rest my foot. A lot of you are saying that. Um, and then I got a like extra long massage at the Four Seasons. He went also, but we get our own rooms. We don't do the whole cup, except for on the cruise, we're gonna do that. But she took a round out of my whole body and it was really good. I um, mean, what she suggested I take is magnesium. So I'm gonna do that, but that's the update. The foot is better, but yeah. So yesterday was epic. The Jollywood Nights party was so good. Do you guys like my outfit, by the way? This is a gift that was sent to me of is Sir Carl. So cute. And then I have Grogu tights on. I'm in full Disney fashion chic. My outfit last night, honestly, if you ever have a cold night or day in Disney, those thermal things that I had on, like I was so comfortable. And then that little dress was like a fur dress. And I said to Andre, I'm like, Disney people are so nice. Like the amount of people that are like, you look so cute. I love your dress. Like love the love. Um, 50s prime time was amazing. We did Midway Mania. We did we did Slinky and I swear Andre thought he was gonna die. Um, so this was just delivered from the holiday party. Oh, it's like actually on a canvas. So they apparently usually give a gift at the party and this time they just figured, I guess, cause we're like all dressed up and people don't wanna carry stuff home and they're also probably intoxicated. So they just delivered it to our front door. Oh, I just thought it was gonna be like a basic like poster thing. This is like on a canvas. Look at how beautiful this is. I think I know where I could put this. Our kitchen is kind of Peter Pan theme. Smells like paint. <laughs> is that not really cool? So I think there is a, thing, a little thing from the artist, like a little note from the artist in here. There is. Certificate of Authenticity by artist Don Ducky Williams. Edition 138 of 175. Sweet cheese, okay. Um, the other thing I'm doing, you just heard it here. Um, we are packing for the cruise. So a couple, I'll mention this a couple times so that nobody men misses it, but I am already setting up to do, and New Year's is quickly approaching. And I'm, I always do this every year. I shift from like holiday, Christmas mode, party, food, drinks, to like New Year's, goals, new you, cruise mode. We don't go on a cruise every year. We did last year and we're going this year. Um, Andre and I are going just us two, which will be so, we haven't been on a trip together alone in so long. Um, four days, completely unplugged, no internet. But my question to you is, do you want me to vlog it? Cause I'm debating not and not like doing technology at all. But if you guys really want me to vlog it, I will. We're going on the wish. I'm so excited. The other question I keep getting, by the way, these are like almost gone. I just checked inventory. We did, I just wanna say we forecasted these really freaking well. They're probably gonna last like right to Christmas, maybe New Year's. Um, and then if there's any left, we're gonna pull them from the website, I think. I think that'd be the plan. So if you want one, get one. New Year's vision board party. I wanted to do it live this year, like actually live. Usually it's as a recording, but I'm on live typing with you, but I'm not actually in real time. I wanna be live in real time. And the only way I can do that is not put the link out to everybody. Um, and here's what the, the other thing I'll say, because I know there's gonna be like three people that are a little bit annoyed by this. I did a full free series live in October and there were less people on live than when I do it privately. So I'm doing it privately. I think that there's more commitment when there's skin in the game. And I'm not putting a Zoom link out publicly. So I think that it's gonna be like the most cool VIP, like bring your champagne, we're doing a vision board party, lot legit live together. It'll probably be, they'll get the announcement. So it's for subscribers on Instagram. They're in the Know Your Worth group and anybody with a planner or a workbook, so the Daily Grind group will get access as well. So basically anybody that usually gets an early access code, and this is like thousands of people, like there's three, I think 3,000 plus people that I'm talking here. So with just that, we'll probably fill it up. And we're gonna do it live. And we're gonna go through all the things that drink champagne together. So there's your answer. Um, that's the vision board party I will mention it a few times. And so right now I'm packing for the cruise. And my office is a disaster. The other thing, the last thing I wanna show you, um, I did decorate. We're good, my battery died. Come with me. So yesterday I decorated. I did the banister all the way up and it looks so pretty with the warmth. We just leave it on um, and it just looks so clean. Okay, let me show you what we just got. Our friends got us this while we were gone. It's a Bambi blanket, so it's gonna go in the Bambi room with Bambi. Freaking love that room. 
we have one video left together. I'm gonna continue decorating because there's a little bit left, but I just wanna say I mashed out the decor. I put a little tree here. This is from Target and it's really long. Like it go, like it was so good. I only needed, I think like three or four of these and they're pre-lit and then I did this like green ribbon, my elf. I do need to vacuum. I did a little gingerbread area. Um, in the next video you guys will see I'm receiving another, I try and get a gingerbread house every year that we're here. I think one year I bought two because this is only our third Christmas here. So I clearly got excited one year, but they're all little gingerbread houses. These used to be outside last year, but they kept falling over. Speaking of, I need to weigh down the Christmas tree outside. It looks so good, but I'm terrified that it's gonna blow away. So I have weights that I can put on it. I could even just use dumbbells. Like I have those, I'm not using them. And you get snuggly. I did a lot. I'm proud of myself. Andre's doing some Lego. I put a pillow out here with Mickey and Minnie. Um, I did the full tiered tray. I did the mantle. I lit up all the palm trees that are just not on right now, but at night it's so pretty. I did the train gingerbread here. I still need to do the bar. I need to wrap all of these gifts. Tiered tray. And then look at this tiered tray. Oh, and you know what I did? So you know how I always do, like, it's my new thing. I have, like, the Stanley that's themed with, I mean, I don't have the green one here, but I have the pink one with him or a one of the park pals. Yesterday, I think I had Baymax on here. I'm already ready for January. I have a full plan for January. It's happening. I'm so excited. So Andre and I are going to head to lunch right now. Um, hopefully you guys are enjoying the Florida. This was a lot of content. This was like two Christmas parties, decorate the house. Hopefully you guys love it. But the next one, we're like at, it's like almost Christmas, like it's happening. So I think you guys will see tomorrow's, yeah, it'll be the 24th tomorrow. So we're just a few days ahead to get everything to you, but I'm so excited. And I'm so excited for our cruise and to go into like New Year's mode, vision board party. There's, oh, we've dropped like a few sneak peeks. I'll show you. I'll get in trouble, but I'll show you. You're gonna like it, you suffer. That's what I said to Andrea, that's how my massage felt. You're gonna like it, but you're gonna suffer. What can I show you without getting in trouble? I'll show you everything. They can't stop me. Okay, I'll show you one divider. Okay, one divider, so without me getting in trouble. And I'll show you one, one cover. Oh, I'm gonna get so much trouble for this. It's so good. Wait, and then there's more. And I'll show you, I showed you green, black, I'll show you one. Can you hear the sound though? And they're bigger. Okay, now we're now we're done because I'm gonna I'm gonna get fired. I'm so excited. So all the things are happening. I will see you guys tomorrow for our last and final video. And then we're gonna go into like New Year's mode, potentially cruise mode, and I'm gonna do the live Zoom vision board party with copious amounts of champagne and popcorn with you guys in the new year. Just make sure that you're subscribed or in the free daily grind group. Cool? Yay! I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye dudes.